If there is a good God, why is there evil? That's a question everybody needs to answer who's a Christian or even just a theist. If there is a good God, why all this evil in the world? So that's the question we're going to try and tackle tonight. And I'd like to start actually in Mexico City. 1985, there was an earthquake, a deadly earthquake. And a great Christian apologist by the name of William Lane Craig, who debates atheists quite frequently on college campuses. I've only done a couple of debates. He's probably done about 50. Uh, He's written a book here called Hard Questions, Real Answers. He has a very disturbing account of what actually occurred in that earthquake in 1985, and also the same year what occurred in a mudslide in Colombia, South America. Here's what he writes in his book, Hard Questions, Real Answers. In 1985, the horror of natural events was brought home to me in a powerful way through two incidents on television. In Mexico City, a terrible earthquake had devastated blocks of high-rise apartment buildings. You can see they just collapsed right upon people. As rescue teams in the aftermath of the quake searched the rubble for survivors, they came across a 10-year-old boy who they could hear, but they couldn't get to. He was trapped alive somewhere in the recesses of the collapsed building. During the next several days, the whole world watched in agony as teams began to remove rubble to try and find the boy. The boy's grandfather had already died, And the boy kept yelling, I'm scared, I'm scared. After about 11 days of searching, there was silence. Alone in the darkness, trapped without food, afraid the little boy died before rescue teams could get to him. Where was God? 